My name is Jacqueline Tacarante, and I own JMT Media. I'm Mike Bloomfield, President Geek of Techie Geek. Top of all, I'm Michael Grazzi, so we are Gotham Trinity Productions. We are a boutique public relations and marketing firm. We primarily service nonprofits and small businesses, specifically in public relations, event marketing, production, design, and tons and tons of social media. Techie Geek is a managed IT service provider, providing four core services. Managed IT services, business continuity, unified communication, and cloud computing. We deliver these services while always focusing on our three core values, clients, culture, and community. In summary, we're the superheroes of IT. We are a video media production company, uh, focused on doing commercial promotional videos, uh, multi-camera broadcasts, live broadcasts, features, shorts, anything with a camera, video camera, photography camera, we want to do it, we want to show it. Been around for about three years and a proud member of the small business community on Staten Island. My chapter has two crises that happened. As a minority women business owner, one of the things that I was learning immediately that there were limited funds in city contracts that were being allocated to Staten Island businesses. So I, along with 10 other significant and important women, created the Minority Women Business Association of Staten Island. The second crisis that we had to work with was, of course, being in this COVID conscious era and producing and pivoting everything that we knew as a normal business model. Interestingly enough, when the pandemic had first hit, I reached out to Dr. Jacob Glanville along with Mike Bloomfield um, from Techie Geek to ask them to be guests. They came on my very first segment it's called Community Corner. Being in IT, over the years, we have seen many crises from natural disasters to human error. For this chapter, we focused on a real life story of a client who was attacked by back-to-back -back ransomware attacks by cyber terrorists. So when March rolled around and we were in quarantine and COVID hit, it was pretty clear we can't go out and do shoots anymore, right? Ooh. Thanks to our good friend, Mike Bloomfield over at Techie Geek and our friend, Andrew Barbachula at Pure Ascision, we decided that the space was broadcasting on Facebook and YouTube. So whatever it was, promotional stuff or about themselves. So we utilized Facebook Live and YouTube to kind of still tell the story of Staten Island people, businesses and entrepreneurs just like ourselves. The biggest takeaway was staying calm, helping the client through every step of the way, and most of all, helping the client to learn and adapt from the crisis. By doing this, the client is now properly protected to minimize their risk, but most of all, prepared should crisis hit again. It was all about resources, 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 just sharing as much information as we could. We were all trying to figure out how do we keep our doors open? How do we keep our staff employed? Um, but more importantly, how do we keep ourselves safe? And it wasn't even necessarily a return on investment of the time and energy and effort. It was really just about sharing the resources and continuously doing what we do best, which is connecting to the community. Just like anyone else, we weren't able to go on location and do our shoots and whatnot. We had to come up with this virtual space and everyone's doing their virtual meetings and whatnot. Well, why not broadcasting and why not uh, utilize online platforms that record video, whether it be pre-recorded or live? And that's one way that we adapted. Because that's the thing, in, in crisis, you, you just have to adapt. You can't just go, you know, with status quo. So, you know, you could either fall from glory or rise from greatness. The ability to adapt is the, probably the best tip that you can give a business owner uh, during a crisis, right, Mike? Absolutely. I mean, you got to find what's working in this new world and, and what's not. Maybe what you were doing previously is not going to work. In the words of our great friend uh, Vinny Bonomi over at Specialties, be seen and stay relevant. Get yourself uncomfortable and get yourself into a vir uh, virtual space. You might have to do some video recordings or things that you don't normally do. You have to get out outside your comfort zone, adapt to what will help you and your business succeed and stick to that. In the midst of a crisis, it is very important that you maintain your cool and stay calm. Don't panic. That will only make matters worse. Also, leverage those around you who can help you to get on the other side quicker and better than you could do it alone. There's no reason to do it alone. Always do everything with passion and integrity uh, because at the end of the day, a lot of it stems from your passion. And so everything that you do, do it with integrity and with humility um, because that will set you apart, um, not just during the middle of a pandemic, but in the future. Stay calm. Stay, Stay calm. calm. Stay calm.